Dead Nabbit Guys. You done it again. We've done it again. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And this is not even all the parcels y'all sent me to my P.O. box. We're gonna have to do another fan unboxing after this one. There's so much stuff. All right, so first and foremost, I just wanna thank everyone who's mailed me stuff to my P.O. box. You guys are amazing. It's located in the video description. By no means do y'all have to send me anything, but if you see something that you think I might fancy or wanna decorate my crib with or whatever, a letter, anything, just send it again. This is only a small fraction of everything I've received, so if I don't unbox your stuff in this video, just know I will in one coming up. All right, so uh, there's one thing that I no longer would like to be sent, and no offense to my boy Salvador, but you sent me three framed postcards of Nipsey Hussle, and they've broken, bro. Like literally every single one of them has, minus one, has broken. And so, we have yet another one, and uh, you got Nipsey, and he has a cut on the picture because the frame is broken, and this at this point is a hazard, but if you guys ever roast me too hard in the comment sections, maybe I can put this to good use. That's kind of dark, but you know what I'm saying? I don't need that no more, bro, but um, your videos, <laughs> love your videos, keep it up. Thank you, bro. I love you too, man. I love you. All right. Unfortunately, my horse with the blade on the hoof is like downstairs too, and it's bladeless right now. It's like in the garage, and we're just doing this now because that's what's happening because my channel, my mother freaking rules. So, <laughs> shout out Holly Raburn or R A Burn Raburn. I love you. I don't know you. But based off the clothes, I love you. All right, let's see what Natalie Holly done sent me. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Would you look at it, dude? Look at it's it. It's an all yellow Reebok polo, essential colors. Nice. Nice. What else we got up in here? Oh, to Tony Stewart. Skirting all up and down y'all tracks. Um, beautiful. A <laughs> little football jersey. Just such unique things, man. Such, such unique eclectic finds from all you guys. Got some blue trunks. Bro, I could tuck this shirt into these trunks and look like an obscure gym coach. Amazing. And then what else we got? All right, got a little, okay, I could hit some links in the Nautica, floral. All right, it might be fun if I did a styling video with y'all's clothes, if I have time. And then we also got some Speedo short shorts. Hey, I actually am gonna wear the hell out of these, bro. These are like high quality. Oh, they're new with tags too. So thank you, Holly. Um, you didn't write me anything, you didn't say anything, but appreciate the clothes, all right? Um, what else we got? Okay, this box is very interesting. Um, the the homie Kuka Clothing, well, I don't even know what your name is, brother. Done sent me this in a Travis Scott Reese's box. All the postage is on the back side, so nice to slap it on right there. Um, I'm gonna tear this box up because guess what? That's what we do. And I have like three of these boxes already. Oh God. Oh my God. I hope I did not just cut that garment. Oh, this is why I should use the horse blade. All right, so inside, let's see what we got. I think I did not damage this at all. Oh, yo, this is clean. I found this jacket in the red colorway and now we have that navy blue on black. This is just kind of like stealth moded. Adidas windbreaker, break wind like a boss. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying. <laughs> and then look at the pull tab right there. Um, really cool. Let's see what else is in here. I hope there's nothing breakable. I think there was. I think there is. Oh no, no, thank God. I'm afraid now, after my boy Salvador sent the stuff, that I'm gonna get chopped up. But you have this uh, Jeff Gordon, wow. Playing cards collection. This is going on a nice little shelf right here, baby. Um, this is cool, I love the tin. I like how it's, you know, switching colors in the light and all that jazz. And then last but not least, oh, whoa, tie-dye? Hello, two cans are better than one. <laughs> What's it say? I'll drink to that. All right, so if you say my last name fast enough, it's like can two, two can, can two, can two, can two, can two, can. Am I saying can two or two can? 
up to you guys. <laughs> All right, um, thank you Thrift God, enjoy Rock and Shock or Flip and Drip. Shout out who, H-U dot C-A underscore clothing. Man, your handwriting is fucking atrocious. And I'm not trying to be rude, but hey, I call a spade a spade. I love you regardless, but Jesus, God, God damn. You be better just writing sentences and emojis, bro. Like, fuck. Anyone can get roasted. Also, I don't know where I just put the scissors. Like, a horse is so much more convenient. All right, so um, this is from my boy Sam at Final Touch Vintage. So this was a housewarming gift. So shout out the man, Mr. Sam. Um, not to be confused with my Uncle Sam. Definitely be taking my shmoney. This is a dainty little thin package. Okay, double wrapped, I like that. Taking care of whatever is inside this trash bag. Oh, oh, I already peeped it. <laughs> Oh, come on, man. Oh, this feels like an eternity, bro. Oh. Y'all ready for this? Oh! What is double-sided like cardboard Houston Rockets sign? I don't even, what was this used for? Bruh, I don't know, but this is going on the wall. This is one of the hardest, if not the hardest Rockets logo. Period. All right, this is, wow, this is amazing. Thank you, Sam. You know what I like. I like what I like. So that's one ting, and I'm saying ting because this full Canadian. Let me see what else my brother from the north sent me. Oh, dude, come on, man. It's too much. It's too much. Oh, let's go. I hate a what? <laughs> I hate a Goofy especially. Oh my dick. I hate a Goofy especially. The homie sent me the Goofy Stripe tee. This is amazing. Goofy's like hitting that hoe too. Wow, that is, that's gorgeous. And then uh, we also have a, you know what I'm saying, a little pinstripe Mickey Mouse embroidered button up. Thank you, brother. You the man. Go peep Final Touch Vintage. You got a store. Check him out if you live in Canada. That's a big place, but Toronto. Let's see, I like getting into some of these boxes. Uh, this video already, I feel like, is taking a long time. But guess what? You guys are here and you guys are watching, so it's whatever. Uh, who sent me this? There's no name on this, bruh. That's very suspicious. I hope it's not like body parts, because this thing's been festering for a minute. Oh, Lord, there is a bunch of odds and ends up in here. All right, let's see what's good with it. Wow. Wow. Okay, look at this. Look what I see just looking in, just gandering. We got some old postcards. Uh, dear Paul, thanks for the laughs. Here is some vintage goodies we found at some yard sales. Congrats on the house. Uh, with love from Moreno Valley, California. Corey and Geofif. <laughs> Geofif? Is that G-E-O-F-I-F? -F? Um, at Screaming Yo Courtyard. At Dirty underscore FK8. Yeah, this handwriting is dope as fuck. All right, look at that handwriting. And then look at the, whoa, look at the card this is on. Bruh, the freaking 12 Lambo. Let's get it. Oh man, we got some other old postcards, the fishes that get you hella bitches. And then this chick got freaking knockers on her and you can put your eyes up to it. This is amazing. All right, let's see what was found at the garage sale. Oh, look at these. Accessorized like a boss. You got the 1996 USA Olympics my freaking uh, pin collection. Wow, that's awesome. You also have this mask. Oh man, this is a little sus. I don't know if I wanna put this on my face. I feel like it's already been on somebody's nose. You got, look at this, Tweety playing tennis. All right, this is the type of stuff I live for. This is just like goodies on goodies. You have this uh, old watch. <laughs> Interesting, all right. I feel like people just emptying drawers on my ass. Um, Okay, you also have like some McDonald's toys, it appears. Um, you have that boy, uh, Bugs Bunny. You got Daffy Duck, and I think these are like a train set. You have Marvin the Martian. I wanna unbag all these, but I don't know if I should. Space Jam Taz, hold up. I had all of these and then I sold them, then I regretted it. And now I'm, I guess I'm building my collection up again. Dude, this is amazing. Man, y'all be showing mad love. Look at this! 
Oh, Toon Squad, you got the little mini dudes. Oh, that is awesome. Um, actually, that's not Toon Squads, that's the Monstars. I'm tweaking. Uh, what else, what else? We got a few more of these train cars. Got Garfield on a scooter. And then, what on this good God's earth is this? Wow. Look at this, brand new in the box, a Dumbo cup. All right, sipping in style. What else? Uh, oh, I got a little clipboard. Fashion clipboard, it's metal. Okay, and then we got shirts too. God dang it, guys. Like, y'all just giving me this stuff. I guess there is a return dress, but like, man, y'all so nice for this. And just blessing other people's eyes with this stuff too. You got that uh, North America metal work? Is that what that said? Uh, men at work? Oh, it's men at work. <laughs> I'm illiterate. Uh, what else? What else? Got a little Superman. Oh, damn. This shit looks ancient. Holy fuck. This smells ancient, too. Good God. I'm sniffing in some, <laughs> some 1950, like, grandma scent right here, bro. Like, this is some old air that I just sipped on with my nostrils. Uh, what else? What is this? Bruh, I played at, uh, Saquon Bingo Palace. <laughs> 1985. Bro, these are all old stuff. I feel like these were size larges, but they just all shrunk due to the age on them. I mean, bro. This unboxing, I'm a great Scott. Shout out all my Scottish people. You have this Looney Tunes tie as well. I need to find a reason to go to formal occasions just to wear these ties. Uh... These are just such random graphic tees from the 80s. It says Gold Strike Tours, Los Vegas. Bingo. That person was an avid bingo player. Oh, this is gonna be some aquatic and erotic shit right here. Look at this. Fishes get you hella bitches, boy. Double-sided coral reef tee. Fuck with who? Fuck with me. You also got some Brewers, Braves, Marlins, Rangers, and Toronto Blow Jays um, stickers. Wow, this is amazing. I feel like this video is already long, so I'm gonna just delve into two more, I think, Bill Parcells. And then we'll have to save the others for another video because I know you guys got things to do, places to be and people to see and all of that. So it says this side first, all right? So, you know, there's been no like, oh, what, what, what? There's been no real deep notes that I could, you know, play some music behind. It says this side first. Uh, all right, what we got? Oh, there's a note in here. I'm about to read this. Oh, this, this shit is some nice handwriting too. It says, ahem, cue the music. Dear Mr. Cantu, Paul, we share the same year of birth, so I just had to hook you up with some personal thrift finds. All these finds should meet or blow away your uh, expertise as thrift guy. I've been watching for years and been truly inspired by your grind and gratitude. Hey, thank you. Thank you. Ah, uh, so much inspired that I just dropped my own thrift store on Instagram at 624 Vintage. Plug the page, Paul. You just got plugged. Um, it says, as you open the package, I got a shirt for Kinky. Throw in some uh, catchphrases. It's all about the, it's all about the you, baby. Hey, homie done did it for me. What's your motherfucking name? Um, Love Lucas Bocker or Boker since 1993. All tree of y'all. Appreciate you, Lucas. Man, you the man. All right, that's redundant. Man, you the man. Let's see what we got right here. Oh man, we got that hot tempered or hot tempered. Uh, hold up. Grab life by the motherfucking horns. That Dodge Ram T right there. Hello, that's a nice piece. All right, oh snap! I just peeped what was in the bottom of the parcel. I don't think y'all supposed to, but hey, I'm a rule breaker, I'm a bad boy. Okay, spank me daddy. Okay, let me stop dude, before I get demonetized. You got the Dallas motherfucking Cowboys. We then boys uh, vintage tea right here as well. Thank you, you know. I love this, Lucas. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, and then we have, of course, um, the fishes that get you hella bitches, bass get you hella ass tea, and it's tied out from the bottom all the way to the top. And then um, I guess this would be, <laughs> yeah, this will be for a little kinky twist. It really is all about the motherfucking you. 
This will probably fit my boy like a crop top, but that's fine. You know what I mean? I'm, I'm ready to see that belly button just be out there feeling the breeze of the winds. Uh, it's the U chain T. And then last and not least, it says, what time is it? Um, man, this is wild. It says 624, I guess 624. Look at that. Oh, look at that medallion right here, baby. Dude, if I was a pirate, I'd get straight murked for this little piece of golden timekeeping doubloonness. This is amazing. I wish I could figure out how to open this right now, but hey, I'd be feeling pressurized uh, when the camera's on. Like I just don't be knowing how to actually function as a as an adult human. So I mean, there's that. Fuck it. I'm gonna fucking I'm gonna figure this out, whether you like it or not. I'm gonna figure this shit out, mate. Oh wait, is that it, bro? What in the gods, <laughs> bro? That took way too long. It's fish on it. Bitches get you hella bitches, man. Thank you so much, Lucas. I appreciate it. And uh, yeah, I'm trying to be humble, but it's kind of hard when you got this golden timekeeping mechanism just ready to hop on chain. All right, but thank you. All right, uno mas, and I'm gonna be that dude, all right? I'm gonna go in, that boy Jade or woman Jade Donovan, send me this package. We going in, baby. Go big or go home, Holmes. So let's peep what the fuck is good <laughs> on this last package. Jay Donovan actually sent me two uh, packages, but guess what, man? Due to time constraints in this video already being long, uh, I'm just opening this one right here. Oh, God damn! Okay, there's some crazy stuff up in here. Hold your horses. Hold the phone. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, he's the homie, man. I met this fool in the fucking... Wait, let me, let me check the address. Where this coming from? Yeah, I think this is the homie I met in the thrift store. Mentioned that they found this uh, piece at the estate sale, not this hat, but this is kind of cool. It's a crazy hat. Um, no, nah, but they sent this remote control holder that is Taz. And so it's like weighted down. So literally homie will just be hanging off the couch. I guess just going crazy. He's kind of relaxing. He's in a relaxed position. And then uh, you put the remote on this side right here or whatever else you want to put in there. I don't know, man. I might just put this on my belt loop and have this be my utility belt with just ignorantly large tasks sticking off it. And it's like two pounds, so high key, I could tie this on my ankle and get some nice ass booty work in, you know, leg gains type shit. I don't skip leg day. Uh, okay. Oh, oh, there's all this Christmas stuff too. I'm late to the party. There's all these Eminem Christmas ornaments. And I wish I would have opened this because I could have put this on my Christmas tree. Oh, wow. God, Jesus. There's some actual bangers in here. Look at this. Last but not least, you have the Space Jam book right here. Um, so maybe I can read this aloud to you guys and like lick my finger. And then, you know, you know when your teacher would and then move, turn the pages, you know, move them. Oh God, that is so many words. This is above my reading level. Come on, man. If this had a one on it, I'd be fine. Oh wow, this shows how it was created and stuff. Whoa, this has a lot of words. I, I can't wait to actually read. Look at this, look at this litter. This is literature. Oh my God. Okay, this is a beautiful book. Thank you so much, Jade. Um, this is amazing. Or if Jade is a woman, Jade's husband, because the person I met was a man. And not that Jade isn't a man's name, but it is the name of a rare gem. Chinese people, they, they sculpt it, you know? Facts. Anyways, all right, so that's gonna conclude awesome dumbass ignorant cultural note. Oh wait, is there, wait, there's a letter in here. Hold, hold the phone. We're not done yet. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I just love being spoiled. It's that boy G Field. <clears throat> it says, these items are not selling for me. D Damn! Getting the leftover? No, let me stop. It says, these items are not selling for me, but I hope they sell for you. I ain't selling these shits. These is mines. Y'all be really thinking I'm trying to flip the gear, y'all Y'all give me. Uh, it says, uh, love the content, underscore Jade, or I guess sign Jade, Instagram, vintage glam for you. Well, thank you, Jade. You're amazing, and this is Hallmark, the Hallmark channel. All right, guys, thank you for watching. Live the dream, eat that ice cream. I love when y'all send me this stuff, even though it does leave a mess on my floor. But hey, I, I, I like being surprised and I like accoutrements and random stuff to decorate the crib with. It's amazing. I truly am blessed that you guys just want to send me this stuff. Y'all don't have to, smashing the like button or not, just watching the videos, commenting or not. 
just showing love and being here with me to share in this moment is more than enough. Thank you so much for real. Live the dream, eat that vegan ice cream. Um, and until next time, baby, I am out. See ya. Killing these songs, leaving a bloody life, I rules to. And I'm in it to win it, so I'm somebody that you should get used to.